What's up, guys? Charlie DeCirco here from the Action Network. My best bet for Monday's slate. We're going to head out to the Mets and Nationals, and it's Patrick Corbin Day, and we're going to fade the left-hander. Pete Alonso over one and a half total bases at plus 100. I'd back that to minus 115. When you look at Patrick Corbin's last few starts, and while they look like he's had success, negative regression is looming for the left-hander. His ERA is nearly one run lower than expected. He's in the bottom 3% of all pitchers in expected batting average, expected to hit 312 against the left-hander. And it's his second straight season of having a plus 500 expected slugging. So just look across the board and Patrick Corbin struggles. And the one area that he's shored up in has been walks, which was the biggest issue for Pete Alonso against Corbin. He walked nine times in 46 plate appearances. He's 13 for 37 career against Corbin with two doubles and five home runs. So over 50% of his hits against a left-hander has gone for extra bases. Corbin, you look at his pitch mix, his velocity has been down. His sinker fastball teed off on his slider, which has been a saving grace all season, has an expected batting average of 260, which is a stark difference from what it's actually outputting right now. So there's a lot of negative regression that point toward Corbin struggling. He's just been a byproduct of facing bad offenses or a few lucky plays here and there. But I'm expecting negative regression to hit him. And I think Pete Alonso is a perfect candidate at home run or at least get on base a couple times here. Pete Alonso, when you look at his numbers against left-handed pitching, despite his struggles this season, he still has a 162 weighted runs created plus against left-handed pitching. That's way above average. That's number one on the Mets by far. And he's over 50% of his hits have come against left-handed pitching for extra bases. He's got a near 1,000 OPS against Southpaws. So Pete Alonso sees them well. And as long as he's not walking, I'm, I'm expecting him to be very live here. I think in, this could easily hit with a home run and one swing of a bat. But I'm expecting extra base power from polar bear Pete Alonso himself. So big, get, big night ahead for him and the New York Mets against Patrick Corbin as we fade Corbin here. A great way to attack him, whether it's a team total or not. But I love Alonzo here over one and a half total bases. Best of luck on all your plays. Let's go, Pete.